Four years after a heartbreaking attempt, ISRO's Chandrayaan is ready to take another leap towards the moon. On Friday, July 14th, Chandrayaan 3 will take off aboard LVM-3, the largest and the heaviest rocket in ISRO's fleet. The 43.5 meter tall rocket, also known as Fat Boy, will embark on a mission that could put India in an exclusive club of nations that have made a soft landing on the lunar surface. Back in 2019, Chandrayaan 2 mission missed by a whisker when it tried to make a soft landing on the moon. After countless hours of dedication, ISRO scientists are ready to conquer the final frontier, mastering the soft landing technology on the lunar surface. If successful, India will join the ranks of United States, China and the former Soviet Union. This is the fourth operational flight of LVM-3. Its primary aim is to deliver Chandrayaan-3 into a geotransfer orbit and subsequently onto moon surface. The launch from Sri Harikota is strategically planned for July because the Earth and Moon are closer to each other during this time of the year, making the mission more feasible. Chandrayaan-3 consists of an indigenous propulsion module, a lander module and a rover each carrying scientific payloads and cutting-edge technology for various missions. One significant addition to the mission is the SHAPE, payload on the propulsion module, designed to study Earth from the lunar orbit, a valuable asset in our quest to understand our home planet and the cosmos. Each module is meticulously designed with specific payloads. The lander is equipped to measure near-surface plasma ions, thermal properties of the lunar surface, and seismic activity. The rover will analyze the chemical and mineralogical composition of the lunar surface, further enhancing our understanding of the moon. As the countdown begins, ISRO's team is eagerly preparing for the launch, conducting rehearsals and making the final checks. After the launch, the propulsion module will orbit the Earth several times, slowly increasing its velocity until it sets course for the moon. The propulsion module carrying the lander will embark on a month-long journey towards the moon before entering a 100-kilometer lunar orbit. From there, the lander will begin the descent towards the moon's south pole, planning to touch down softly in late August. So why is it landing on the south pole of the moon? Basically, the south pole of the moon is a region with a high potential for the presence of water in permanently shadowed areas. As Chandrayaan-3 soars towards the moon, it carries with it the hopes and dreams of a nation and aspiration of making the impossible possible. So join us as we witness history in making with Chandrayaan 3 launching on July 14 at 2.35 p.m. This is Saurav Kumar. Thanks for watching.